Bloggers. Hi, my name is David Gloss. I'm here at the White House in the South Lawn, getting ready to go through security. Um, I see the rubber gloves, and I'm a little uh, anxious. Um, but uh, I'm here um, by invite uh, from Michelle Obama uh, to begin the process in a large group with over 1,500 chefs here today. Um, really get people on board to start giving chefs information and data and give us true ways to network um, and sponsor uh, local schools and it's about healthy choices for children. My name is John Kearns from City Grocery in Oxford, Mississippi. Here at the White House for a cause that's become unbelievably important to me because it ought to be important to everyone. This is about ending childhood obesity, about educating children, about eating well in the classroom and changing the way that the programs in the schools work. More importantly, changing kids' understanding of food. That's why we're here today. Thank you. My name is Kyle Armstrong from Restaurant Eve. In Alexandria, Virginia, we're here at the White House. We're going to kick off the chef's move to schools uh, uh, plan with the, with the first lady and get uh, fix the nutrition problem in schools. My name is Jeff Tonks. I'm here for the Let's Move for the Chef's White House Initiative. Okay. R.J. Cooper, Vidalia. Why am I here? For the kids. We got to change lunch because it's terrible. And with three and a half year old twins going to school, they're not going to eat that stuff. That's why we're here. All strong, all one. What are you? Hi, Michael Lascones from La Brunner Den in New York City. I'm here entering the White House as we speak uh, to participate in Michelle Obama's uh, Let's Move uh, initiative. Um, and I'm having a great time hanging out with my friends David Guas and uh, Lynn Hopkins. Hi, I'm Lynn Hopkins from Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, I'm here to uh, be a part of a formal initiation of chefs becoming involved in their partner schools in their neighborhoods. And the First Lady has really uh, called uh, chefs to action about this very important issue and it's uh, something we've been doing in Atlanta and uh, I'm just proud to be a part of it and, and uh, help in that engagement. Hi, I'm Kathy Gunst. I'm a writer. I live in southern Maine and I'm really interested in writing about all of this and really, really can't find a better cause in helping educate kids in what real food tastes like, getting rid of the frozen box foods in our school cafeterias, and just helping people along from a very early age. Hi, I'm Janice McLean and I'm the chef at 15 Ria and I'm here to support bringing healthy food to our kids. I do a lot of cooking demonstrations in DC public schools through AIWF Days of Taste, Fresh Farm Markets Food Prints, and Les Dom Green Tables. My name is Bristol Cost and I'm here because I think this is brilliant, getting the chefs of the country together to help we feed people for a living and to feed these kids and surround them with foods that are good for them from the get-go is so much what we should be doing. It's really fabulous. It's wonderful to be here with you. Before I'm here. I'm, I'm at the White House. My name's Robert Weedmeyer from Marcel's, Bras, Rebecca, and Bravo. And my good friend here, David Gwas. Come here, David Gwas. Get your ass over here. And Cahal Armstrong. Come here. This is my going on buddies. YouTube. My good buddies. Get over here, David. My good buddies, David Gwas, Cahal Armstrong. We're here at the White House to support the, the childhood hunger and what they're feeding our kids in schools. And we're just glad to be part of it. I want each of y'all to tell me what you What's feed your, your kids. Huh? Tell me what each of y'all feed your kids. For school lunches. Do you make their school lunches? Uh, we make our school lunches at home. And so what do you make? So give me an example. Yeah, well, just the you know, nice healthy uh, vegetable sandwiches, you know, bacon, Cucumbers, lettuce, and tomatoes. Marcel and Beck, all they eat is boudin. 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 Just good stuff. And at my house, boudin, boudin, boudin. 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 And what about you, Cahol? Bacon, bacon, bacon. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's got ruin in it. Hey, as long as it's all natural, it doesn't matter if it's bacon or if it's, you know. That's cheese. good. As long as, as, long as it's, it's good, as long as it's natural and not processed. That's what it's all about. And you know the joy of cooking for others. Uh, that passion that you get, the sense of camaraderie, uh, the understanding and fulfillment that comes with seeing folks gathering around a t dinner table, uh, not just enjoying a meal, but enjoying fellowship. That is power. Uh, you know the central role that food plays in the moments that uh, make us happiest. Food is always there. <laughs> Whether it's at a birthday party or Thanksgiving dinner or quiet moments with friends, food is at the core of what makes life wonderful. And you all know how the ingredients we 
put in our bodies uh, can affect the way we feel, uh, the way we think, and how we grow. One understands nutrition and food. It's the folks sitting here in their whites today. I know what they're called, whites. <laughs> we tease uh, Sam, we call them blouses. Just to make them mad. <laughs> but each of you has so much to offer when it comes to helping our children make healthy choices. You know more about food than almost anyone, other than grandmas. Uh, and you've got the visibility and the enthusiasm uh, to match that knowledge. That's really what's key. Uh, just watching you guys in action will, it excites me, mm. let alone my little girls who can't stay out of the kitchen when Sam is cooking.